Hi guys, this is Sliver here, and this is the story of how I got my mythic unique item, more specifically a Shaco, on my character. I decided to make a video of this for two reasons. First, maybe some of you are interested in an easy and fast way of getting mythic uniques that doesn't involve farming hours for boss materials or spending real money on shady websites. The second, and the most important reason is that I believe that the way I was able to obtain this endgame extremely sought after item highlights multiple problems with the game. But I will let you guys decide about that later. Now for the method. So all I did was look up the gold price of exquisite blood on a trading website called Diablo.trade. I'm not sponsored by the way. Thousands of Diablo players use that site, since Blizzard doesn't have an in-game trading system. Anyway, I found out that one exquisite blood goes for between 5 to 8 million gold. Then I logged in-game and started advertising on trade chat that I wanted to buy a stack, so 50 items of exquisite blood for 100 million gold. And I believe on my second post to trade chat, I got a guy who wanted to sell. As you can see, the trade went fine, and now I have one stack of blood that I bought for 100 million. Next, I listed these bloods on the Diablo trade website for 250 million gold, so 5 million each. It instantly sold, and there I was with 150 million gold profit instantly. I did the same thing a few times, and since the profit margin was so high, I kept a few stacks of blood for myself while still making a large profit. Next, still, without doing any farming myself, I joined a group for Tormented Zir and did some rotations. And this is how I managed to get my hands on some of the best items in the game without even playing the game, farming or barely any effort at all. Now, as I said, you could consider this story a guide and follow it. You can easily replicate what I have done and get yourself any mythic unique in the game. But that is not really the point of the video. The point is, is this right that something like this can happen? Should you be able to get these amazing items just by capitalizing on other people's lack of knowledge about the real value of items. Would an in-game auction house solve, or at least partially solve the issue? Because believe me, this does not stop with getting a mythic unique. Players who use these sites get their hands on the best items, like amulets with greater affixes of passive skills and such. Items that an average player would have to farm for weeks. Do you think this is how it should be? I don't, and I think an auction house might be helpful in preventing this, or at least making it less of an issue. You could also say that who cares if someone else gets way more powerful with way less effort than someone who doesn't abuse these trading websites. You just play your own game and not care about the others. Well, I truly disagree with this opinion. I think in a multiplayer game, it matters how fast and in what ways others are able to gear up. But that's just my take. So this was my story. You can take it as a guide, something to think about, or both. Either way, feel free to comment, like and sub for more, and see you guys next time. Thanks.